I could have slept the entire day away. The pregnancy fatigue was so real today. After yesterday, I decided to sleep in as much as I can because if I do have this baby early, I just wanted to make sure I'm really well rested. When I woke up, I laid there for about an hour and just stared at the ceiling, just absolutely dreading my day. My fingers and toes have finally started to swell to where I can barely put my wedding ring on. Braxton Hicks is no joke, you guys. Like, it freaks you out. It makes you feel like, oh my god, I'm going to go into labor right now. It's pretty crippling anxiety. After yesterday, I could not handle not being prepared, so I washed every single thing that I could even look at, see. Anything that I saw that I thought that maybe potentially needed to be cleaned, I just cleaned it. The shitty thing is that it's over 100 degrees outside, and one of my last tasks is cleaning out my car. But who in their right mind is going to stand outside in 115 degree weather to vacuum out their stinking car? The overall excitement of meeting my daughter and having a baby is definitely present, but then I realize that I have to have a surgery while I'm awake, and for whatever reason, that thought has completely overtook my mind and made me almost forget that I'm having a baby because I'm so anxious about the surgery. I just want to get it over with. Like, I just want to fast forward time so that I don't have to be on the table. I think that I've been alone with my thoughts too much this week. Has anyone else freaked themselves out so much that they forget about the good stuff coming too? Like that song, can we just skip to the good part? Please, dear Lord, can we just skip to the good part? I've come to the conclusion that anytime somebody wants to come and meet the baby, whether it be at the hospital or at my house, they have to bring food. Like, that is your entry fee. Not just food, though. Like, give me high-quality sushi and a cold turkey sandwich. And if those things are not in your hands when you try to come over, like, you will be turned away. Goodbye. Have a good day. Just give me that damn turkey sandwich. Also, none of my clothes fit me anymore, and my belly sticks out of all of them. Anyways, okay. Good night, guys.